It is seriously hard to believe that back in 2004, it was the end of Hey Arnold. That's when we said goodbye to these characters. But 13 years later, we actually have the opportunity to see these characters in a new adventure at least one last time. I never thought I'd see the day and it's actually here. Now the question is, is it worth the wait? Let's find out what I thought of Hey Arnold the Jungle Movie. You know I'm ready when I'm wearing this shirt. Well, then again, I did wear this shirt in my Hey Arnold the Movie review, but you know I'm ready. I'm definitely ready. Hey there, everybody. This is 22 Tiger Dude here, and I am here to review Hey Arnold the Jungle Movie. So Hey Arnold the Jungle Movie obviously takes place after the events of the original cartoon Hey Arnold, as Arnold wants to go find his missing parents because he has been wondering for so long where his parents have been. And so when he gets his opportunity to win a trip to San Lorenzo, he wants to use that opportunity to go there to find his parents. However, things didn't work out for him, but thanks to the help of Helga and the rest of Arnold's friends, Arnold actually wins a trip to San Lorenzo and now Arnold and his classmates, they do go to San Lorenzo and while there, Arnold uses the opportunity to go out and find his missing parents. So if you have just watched my movie review for Hey Arnold the Movie, as I said in that review, I am a massive Hey Arnold fan. I love Hey Arnold. It's one of my favorite cartoons of all time. I said it in that review and I will say it again here in this review. I do consider it my second favorite Nickelodeon cartoon of all time. Sponge of Squarepants, obviously, is my number one. I adore the cartoon so much. And when I heard that Nickelodeon was actually going to bring back Hey Arnold one last time in movie form, you can't imagine how excited I was. So, after all this wait for this movie, was this worth the wait? Absolutely. Absolutely. I love Hey Arnold, the Jungle Movie. Yes, this is way better than the 2002 theatrical film. Way, way better, thank goodness. Because that was a disappointment. This one, however, far from a disappointment. This movie, I will tell you straight off the bat, completely captures everything I love about the cartoon. The characters still feel like the characters from the cartoon. The overall style of the show still feels like the style from the cartoon. Really the only difference in this film is the animation and that's because obviously after so many years and with technology advancing, the animation is going to look more colorful. It's definitely more colorful, more brighter, and that's not to say the cartoon wasn't colorful because it definitely was, but obviously because time has passed since the original show, the animation does look more colorful. It's a little bit more detailed as far as the drawing goes. The animation, honestly, in Hey Arnold the Jungle Movie looks fantastic. It doesn't look off like with some of Hey Arnold the Movie. There's not a single moment where I thought the animation was off. In fact, I would even say this felt more theatrical than the theatrical movie. And this is a TV movie I'm talking about. The storyline in this film I found to be so well written. It is so engaging. And I'm going to be careful when I talk about this film because I really want you guys to go into this movie and just be pretty surprised because they do throw in some surprises in this film. Like there were things in this movie I actually didn't see coming. This is a very funny movie. There's so many moments in this film where the humor really did make me laugh honestly. I really love the humor in this film. Felt exactly like the humor in the original show. Definitely wasn't disappointed as far as that goes. And just seeing these characters 
was so delightful. It feels so good to see Arnold again. It feels so good to see Gerald again. It feels so good to see, well, okay, maybe not Helga. Um, Helga has always been my least favorite character when it comes to Hey Arnold. But I will say this, I will say this, I did really like Helga here because I'm not gonna really say too much, but there are definitely moments with Helga that I think fans will be pleased with um, as, without spoiling anything. Um, Helga actually did surprise me here. It's not like I hate Helga. She's not a horrible character. She's just a character that got on my nerves. And look, I get it. She crushes on Arnold. And the way she hides her feelings for Arnold is to be mean to him and all that. But that's just what always got on my nerves with the character. And even the other side characters like with Rhonda, with Harold, with Eugene, with Sid, all of these other kid characters. We actually do get a little more screen time with them here. Definitely way more than the theatrical film because in the theatrical film you barely see them. In this film you actually get a good amount of moments with them. Now obviously they don't have as much screen time as Arnold, Gerald, and Helga do because obviously the three of them are on their own separate adventure but the moments you do get with the other kid characters was really great they all had at least one moment to just really be funny and really just stick out how this film did handle the story of what happened to Arnold's parents was really, really fascinating to me. I really don't want to say anything more than that because there really is a lot to the story. They did actually take their time with the storyline. They fleshed it out and never felt like a convoluted mess. The balance when we follow Arnold, Gerald, and Helga, and then when we follow like the other kids, and then other stuff that I really don't want to give away, that was actually handled very well. Craig Bartlett, who is the creator of Hey Arnold, and a few others, they wrote this film, and you could really tell that they took their time. I honestly was very impressed with how this movie overall was written. There's definitely a lot of fun moments, but when the film gets a little more serious and a little more dark, it definitely goes there and it's not really afraid to go there which I do appreciate and another thing I have to just really credit the team in general for is just really wrapping this whole entire series into a nice bow and I did really love the callbacks to the original show like obviously if you're someone like me that has followed the entire show then you're gonna understand some of the callbacks that this movie delivered and one thing I have to give credit for too before I even forget because I almost forgot to bring this up the voice acting after all of these years the voice actors really really sounded like these characters now I know not every single one of them are the same voice actors there's definitely obvious ones like Dan Castellaneta um, who voices grandpa and others but I know not everyone in this voice cast are like the same ones but I have to even say even to the new actors that would fill in for the original voice actors to voice these characters man it doesn't sound like they replaced any voice actor at all because the characters sound the same. Arnold sounds like the exact same Arnold from the original cartoon. Same with Gerald, same with Helga, same with Grandpa, same with Grandma, uh, Sid. Just, you know, there's a ton of characters in the show, but wow, I am just so amazed. As far as problems do go for Hey Arnold the Jungle Movie, I do think the movie drags just a little bit, not a whole lot. It would just be a little bit when the movie would drag, but eventually it does pick up, so luckily it's not really for that long. The movie is very obvious when it comes to its antagonist, and I'm, I really want to be very secretive 
with this antagonist because believe it or not there's actually quite a bit when it comes to this character but let's just say the reveal of this antagonist was so so obvious like it was just so predictable that it was this certain character and I'm going are you being for real I love you movie but are you really being this obvious when it comes to this antagonist there's a few times where the humor didn't work, but that's really far in between when that would happen. And really, my final flaw with Hey Arnold! The Jungle Movie is that, without spoiling anything, there's a scene with Arnold, Gerald, and Helga. And let's just say the stakes get high in this scene. Like, these characters are in absolute peril. But then the scene just ends abruptly. Like, it just ends abruptly and the characters just move on from there. Overall, I loved Hey Arnold, the Jungle Movie. I really love this movie. I honestly couldn't have asked for a better conclusion to the Hey Arnold cartoon we didn't get back in 2004, but even if we waited 13 years later to get it, I am so glad we did. This is not only a great movie that I am for sure going to be rewatching, but it also serves as just a satisfying and great conclusion to the cartoon. My second favorite cartoon of all time. It was very exciting for me to see these characters one last time. The animation is fantastic. Where they took the overall storyline was so creative. There's a lot of passion and care that went into this film. The voice acting is great. The humor is great. Not to mention the adventure adventure itself is actually exciting like there's actually a ton of adventure in this film i was very happy overall with the adventure vibe that was very exciting and it did have me at the edge of my seat at times thank you so much nickelodeon for giving craig bartlett the creator of hey arnold and the rest of the team the opportunity to bring us this movie seriously Thank you, Nickelodeon. I honestly couldn't be any happier. I am going to give Hey Arnold the Jungle Movie three and a half out of four stars. And on a TV scale, I would give it an eight out of ten. So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know. What did you think about Hey Arnold! The Jungle Movie? Did you really like this movie? Were you disappointed by this movie? Did you think it served as a nice conclusion to the show or not really? I would definitely be interested to know everyone's thoughts. This is 20 to Tiger Dude here. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power! <laughs>